your own expense. The closest port from England is Calais, which spells C-A-L-A-I-S. For your information, the basic contract with the Foreign Legion is five years. The Foreign Legion ban recruitment if you have been charged with murder crime or drug related conviction. Bonjour. Um, I've come to join the, the Legion in Trangier. Yes, Bonjour, monsieur. Bonjour. C'est pourquoi? I've come to join the, the Legion in Trangier. Okay. Okay. Come on. I'm very, very nervous. Um, it's a long way away from home. Um, I'm not very good at speaking French either, you know, so I think that's going to be a big, big problem for me. Your name is Dean William Heggie. Yeah, okay. Okay, you come here to join up the Legion for five years, that's it? Yes. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay. You know, if you want to join, we keep charge of you immediately from this moment now. And you're not allowed to write or to telephone for minimum four months, three or four months, yeah, you know that? Yeah. Okay. We pass you in front of a doctor this afternoon. Okay. If the medic decides you are fit to join, then you sign your five years contract this afternoon. Back home, uh, I mean, my parents don't know I'm here, for a start. <laughs> um, I think the only person that knows that I'm here uh, is my uncle, my uncle Frank. Um, but apart from that... Mm, None of my friends, no, none of my family. Uh, no one. Quel est uh, votre motive de venir à la Légion étrangère? What is your motivation to enlist in the Legion? Um, I've joined for uh, adventure and for a military career. Avez-vous des problèmes avec la justice en Angleterre? Do you have any problems with uh, justice with the police in uh, Great Britain? No, not at all. No problem? No. Vous allez maintenant signer un contrat pour 5 ans provisoire pour l'instant ici à, à Paris. Signé ici. That is the first contract here in Paris which will become uh, definitively after a period of uh, tests. five years in the Marines um, left the Marines and uh, it was about a month in civilian life it was boring really you know just sitting about the house watching television I just needed another challenge you know? bit of excitement bit of adventure I think the next challenge was uh, the French Foreign Legion
Je vous note sur French Money. Non. Non. Donc, ça non plus, il n'y a pas besoin. Vous mettez dedans. Vous mettez dedans. Vous fermez. Deux shorts. Trois t-shirts. Ça va, Iggy. Ça va. Voilà. Bon. Si votre niveau général n'est pas assez élevé, on vous remettra aussi dehors. Si vous n'êtes pas apte physiquement, on pourra aussi vous remettre dehors. Et si votre examen de situation ne convient pas, on pourra aussi vous remettre dehors. Each one of these tests count whether or not you're going to stay with us in the French Foreign Legion. The infirmary test, we can leave, you can leave maybe today, maybe tomorrow, depending on how things go. Afterwards, the intelligence test, if you are not intelligent enough, the same thing, we put you back to the civilian life. Physical test, same thing, if you do not get the 2,600 meters which we need, you're back to civilian life. 12 minutes. 12 in Kutsipé. Stop. Okay. Te pray. Two thousand six is the absolute limit. Anything under two thousand six hundred meters and there'll be civilian by the end of the evening. Gone. At the end of each day we kick out between fifteen and twenty five guys. Each day. So for every thirty five they get to cast out for the end of the week. There's about a hundred and something that are kicked out. Continue, cool, cool, continue. Tu pas encore fini? Okay. Okay. At the moment, he's got what? Three, four minutes left, and he's just done the absolute minimum, so he's passed the test already. Now it's a question of well, how well he gets marked on this sheet, whether he's excellent, Trebian or good. So hopefully, he's going to pass. But I said like I'm biased because he's ex-British Army. Okay. I, wasn't, uh, I wasn't concentrating on the time I had, you know. Um, if I knew... Uh, if two minutes to go, I would have, I would have uh, sprinted for the last two minutes. But, uh, easy. Give me harder. Give me more punishment. Schön, also die Kondition von der Kondition her hat es einigermaßen gereicht. Bloß habe ich einen Krampf gekriegt im Fuß. Da musste ich aufhören. Wenn ich Schmerzen gehabt habe, der ganze Schenkel war verkrampft. Habe ich aufgehört und jetzt muss ich halt zivil gehen. Und in drei Monaten kann ich wieder herkommen. Dort, von zivil. Also, never to tell you. Wie den Sack, die müssen wir parte. Tu es qui appartient de Legion. Tu n'as pas été. Voilà, tu peux le faire. Some of them didn't pass the test this morning. Mr. Gott, sir, he didn't pass the, the minimum level of running, the minimum level, so he was kicked out this afternoon. And then, of course, there's a, a certain guy that was caught sleeping with somebody else last night, so uh, he's not the type of person one in the Legion, and he's gone as well. Strasbourg. Yep. Boom. Pendant qu'on reste là-bas, mets-toi en repos. C'est la première fois que tu te présentes chez nous Is this the first time you have tried to join the Legion In the book. Pour. Is this the first time that you have come here to yeah. be in the Legion The first time. First time. Yes Yes. Célibataire, marié, divorcé, séparé, des enfants Are you single, 
married or divorced? Single. Do you have any children? Approche pas du bureau, tu te mets là, mets-toi au repos. Au repos. Bon, désirais-tu euh, être sous anonymat Oui, major. Changer de nom Oui, major. Oui, pour quelle raison particulière euh, Disons surtout pour faire une nouvelle vie. Oui. Parce que bon, disons euh, que la vie civile pour moi ne me convient pas vraiment. Donc je vais redémarrer à zéro dans des conditions différentes. Tu as eu des problèmes avec ta famille euh, J'ai eu des problèmes avec ma famille, oui. Et donc c'est de ça peut-être qui. Il y a aussi un petit peu de ça euh, au niveau de la copine aussi. D'accord, ok, mais j'ai compris. Voilà. Euh, on va voir ça. Moi aussi, Major. Tu peux disposer. Major. Donc, ton nom c'est Iggy Rompo. Tu t'appelles Iggy. Nationalité Écossais. C'est la première fois que tu te présentes chez nous. Is this the first time you tried to join the Legion? Yes. Est-ce qu'il désire être sous anonymat, changer de nom Do you wish to become anonymous and change your name Non. The BSLA, uh, the Bureau of Statistics, we call it the Gestapo. Uh, basically, it's an uh, interrogation. I mean, personally, I was in there for two hours. Um, and they ask you everything um, from the day you were born about your family everything about your your civilian career um, past military experience if you have any everything Iggy Iggy the interview is designed to find out your background to see if you've had any criminal connections just to see that everything's okay on their side of you Simple. A murderer is not tolerate. A guy who stole from money in a bank, for instance, with a gun, is not tolerate. He's dangerous. A guy who steals a car uh, in the evening like that uh, can be tolerate. There is no problem. But what I know about it, the the rules is no murderer, okay, and no guy dangerous. Écoutez tout le monde. Sortez le capi, le sachet, et mettez sous la tête. Essayez tous les trois. Comment 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 Ne touchez pas le blanc que le loueur. Ça se fait tout la tête. Mettez tout la tête. Put it on your head. Step back. Don't touch the white. Ne touche pas le blanc que le noir. Don't touch the white, just the black. This bit is very easy to get it dirty and you'll be scrubbing it out. Okay, that seems about right. Okay, take it off. I'm getting on great because I've met uh, um, a lot of English speaking people, a um, couple of blokes from Scotland, um, blokes from Ireland. <laughs> um, I, I think, uh, to be truthful, the French keep themselves to themselves and the British keep themselves to themselves. 
but that's going to all change when we get to Castel. They're going to split people up, so you're going to get on and you're going to be working with with everybody, <coughs> uh, whether it be French, Russian. Or uh, we're looking forward to it, you know. Just been three weeks here now. It's a good feeling to pass all the tests. And just get on to the military side of training now, you know. In some ways, I'm nervous. Um, I think everyone's blind. They don't know what we're going to be in for. Um, we do know it's going to be a hard time. Section à la disposition du sous-officier du 4e régiment étranger. Section à ma disposition, à vos ordres, Major. Ça veut doubler, il veut voir deux, deux plis, et pas juste une. Ok, après, vous suivez le pli. Ok, on voit. Tu montres. Voilà, tu continues, tu fais encore deux plis. Tu montres à tout le monde. Bienvenue au quatrième étranger. Ce régiment, c'est votre régiment. Okay, but English, you don't have your, your white cap yet, but this is your regiment. Vous allez tout d'abord découvrir l'esprit de la Légion étrangère. You will learn the spirit of the French Foreign Legion. Deuxièmement, vous allez apprendre à parler français. You will learn to speak French. Troisièmement, vous allez apprendre à tirer avec le fusil français qui s'appelle le FAMAS. Je vous redis bienvenue au quatrième étranger. Et rendez-vous à la fin du premier mois pour la remise de vos képis blancs. Permission entrée. On garde les volontaires ici un mois de service, troisième compagnie. Section de Lutonon, à Rattaré, à vous en mon Lutonon. J'ai ma mère à Ropo, à vous en mon Lutonon. Ok, comment t'écris ton nom Eddy, Dean, mon Lutonon. Ouais, alors ça s'écrit comment Euh, 23. 
Comment tu l'écris Sperm. H I W G I E. H. Répète H. Répète H. E H I E E G G I E. Non I. Pas I I. I. Non I I. Hegi. Donc tu viens d'où Hegi? Ton pays. Ton pays, chez toi. Ta ville. Tu habites où Tu es anglais Écosse et anglais. Oui, voilà. Donc tu viens d'Écosse. Ok Écosse. Écosse. Voilà. assemble them on out in the, the corridor there all the time like they're always calling you out at stupid hours of the day and uh, I'm just really tired of it like okay we call them out more than once because um, when when the sergeant comes to take the pill we count them to see if they're all here and it's counting in French the guys have just arrived and they're not counting the counting is not what's well, not good it's obvious it's not good because they they knew so we get them back in the rooms to practice the counting. It's the French guys normally who give, who give them a hand. Then we call them out again to see how it goes. And this goes on until until they get it right. Yesterday we were all lined up outside and we were about three seconds adrift. So the corporal just lined us up and went from one end, punching every single person, to the other end. Yeah, the beatings is uh, quite daunting. Yeah, they hit you quite hard, since what I've seen. Um, there's a, uh, what was he? I think it was a Portuguese guy. His name's Akros. He's uh, got a few bruises in his chest and that. So, um, it's just because he's Portuguese, really. Tomorrow, uh, we're leaving for a place called The Farm. Um, it's basically a month of uh, basic training, field craft, uh, the chanting, the, the singing, marching, uh, a lot of running, a lot of physical training. Um, now, from what I've heard from people that have come back from the farm, um, it is hell.
Je veux que tout le monde travaille, francophone, non francophone, tout le monde est volontaire ici. Alors ceux qui vont commencer à buller derrière, dans les petits coins, on va vite les trouver. Mais Pam, c'est comme ça. Oui, corporal. Oui, corporal. Oui, corporal. On t'a pas Oui, oui corporal En bas. En 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 En Ok. Pantalon de survêtement. Répétez. Pantalon de survêtement. Répétez. Pantalon de survêtement. Répétez. Pantalon de survêtement. Il va. Allez, on tire sur les bras. Ça va. Hop, poste. Là, tiens-moi cette jambe là. Ah, 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 normalement. Faites pas de panique. Ah, ah, ah. Eh, euh, hein. Ah. Hey, vous allez beaucoup euh, apprendre, hein. Réponds. Et si. Normal, normal. Non, 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 c'est pas normal. Ok. Voilà, c'est bien. Hop. Hop, plus grand, plus grand. Ok, normal. Uh -huh. Normal. Mm -hmm. Pas... Hop. Non, normal. Marche normalement. Normalement. Voilà, normalement. Voilà, c'est bien. Ça, c'est bien. Il n'y a pas de panique. Personne qui te va bouffer ici. Ok, tu comprends C'est ça. Voilà, rejoins-le.
Tu peux disposer. Tu peux disposer. Ah. Ton argent, je le garde. Ok C'est ton argent, mais je le garde. On les reconnaît de suite. Je <coughs> 500, 1000, 1050, 1070, 1090, tu peux disposer. Oh le le combat qui commence, bon ça, ça veut dire ce que ça veut dire, mais dans nos âmes, enthousiasme et vaillance. C'est-à-dire, il faut toujours qu'on ait l'âme à combattre. Troisième phrase, cela de France, cela du pays. Nous remontons vers les lignes. Soldats de France, soldats du pays. Nous remontons vers les lignes. Ok Soldats de France. Hop, oh, silence. C'est moi qui dis 3, 4, d'accord S'il y en a qui veulent pomper, qui veulent faire à monter en haut de la colline, ils disent. Soldats de France. 3, 4. Soldats de France. Soldats du pays. Nous remonterons vers la ville. Ok. sortir un peu de leur coquille parce qu'ils sont un peu renfermés. Je trouve, pour moi, le choix n'est pas terrible. Écoutez, c'est pas... C'est pas trop bon. Mais bon, s'ils continuent comme ça, ils vont grimper sur la petite montagne qui se trouve derrière. Allez, redescends, redescends. À fond, là. Ça fait partie intégrale de l'instruction, de la cohésion. Alors chantez. Oh. En bas. Oh. Oh, 
Ok, je vais te faire un peu de temps. Je vais te faire un peu de temps. Je vais te faire un peu de temps. Alors, les présentations, vous allez présenter, présenter un caporal, il va vous surveiller. Si c'est pas bon, vous n'allez pas dormir. Quoi. Les chambres impeccables. C'est que Oui, oh, oh. 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 Oh, I'm really annoyed, really seriously pissed off at the moment because <laughs> they change everything every day and uh, they talk too much. Uh, people here are really pissing me off at the moment. Uh, at, at, at this time, I, I'm just getting fed up with it because some of these things <laughs> are totally stupid. The, the, Typically, the French, they act childish. They can't queue up. They don't know how to organise themselves. They're uh, <laughs> totally thoughtless of other people. They just them, them, them. Um, the, the Brits, we, we keep together. We're actually trying to sort out our rooms. We, saw, we try and help other people as well as ourselves, but when we do, we get bollocked for it. And then we try and give advice when we've had experience, territorial or forces, or otherwise. The uh, civilians here, like themselves, just don't, don't give a shit, basically. And um, that's what pisses myself off and probably annoys Dean and the other Brits. Been messed about a lot, you know. No sleep. Uh, constantly in the, the push-up position all the time. <laughs> I'm sick of it. Hey, come on, you good? Come on, get. You speak it. Ça, ça de pas bon. De pas si et de la position. Ça claro. Ça, regarde encore. Que j'ai dit sur ma tête. Tu nous informes maintenant. Hein? Répète, Franck Fouan, c'est qui là C'est quoi ça Ils sont pas là, c'est les pistolets. Mec, tu nous c'est qui C'est Franck Fouan. C'est Franck Fouan. Incroyable ça. Tombe, 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 for every army in the world what the, the how disciplines enforced and built up is, is is a standard is a standard practice and obviously we have our, our little so called tricks of the trade etc but they aren't designed to to um, uh, how can I say degenerate a human being at all it's just done for for their good but obviously yes it's, it is it is very tough here you know I'm, I'm not going to say it's it's a holiday here it's it's tough it's hard it's the French foreign legion Come on, j'espère. Tout arrangé, c'est bouclé. C'est 
Boucler, oui ou non Oui, 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 pas bouclé Pas bouclé Pas bouclé Ça, c'est pas bon C'est pas bon ça Il est dit autrefois, pour que tout le monde reste Mais non Dis, bouclé. Dis, bouclé. Dis, bouclé. Mais non, c'est pas merde, non. Ça, bouclé. Non. Faut donc, non. J'ai tous, non. J'ai tous, tous. Ah non, j'ai tout ça, non, c'est pas bon. I'm, I'm so tired that, I mean, I've had about, in the past week, all together I've had about, I must be about 15 hours sleep, you know, I'm living there if, if, if that. <laughs> Falling asleep in French classes, being punished for that, but we had about fucking three hours sleep within about 48 hours and uh, the punishment for that was outside strip off I mean it's freezing cold at night you know and uh, strip off they hosed us down with freezing cold water and told us to stand there for an hour it's it's not me I'm not uh, a military run I thought I was following my father and my family in the forces and coming here to foreign legion to make a difference in the family but it's probably my Christian upbringing which has been in my backbone but it's the soldiering I find too too hard it's stressful for me I think the stress started to get to, to Dave like I mean constantly running about constantly on the move, constantly having to be motivated, no sleep. What we were told before we came here was, it's a psychological, it's a battle of them and you, and they're trying to break you down, and like with Dave, you know, he just, you think they're broken. They bring out the rest of your comrades from your dog to watch you do the punishment, you know, and then later on when they go back, um, one of the corporals just comes up and hits you on, tells you not to do it again, takes you back, and if you've still done it again, takes you outside. Yeah. And it's, it's done it now. I probably expect more, more punishment when I get cast out.
reckon they do two days of marching and then bivouac somewhere tomorrow night and then march again Sunday. And it's a 50k march for the Capi Blanc. At the end of the march, there's a little ceremony where they put their Capi Blanc on for the first time. They say the code of honor. And then they become legionnaires. And on touche, regardez tout ça là. On touche cette partie là. On touche pas partie ici là. Pour que lui il sorte juste là. Et tu vas prendre la place de lui là. Je suis pas le blanc. Hein Ce fagnon est le symbole de votre volonté d'obtenir les meilleurs résultats ensemble à la fin de votre instruction. Engagé volontaire de la section du lieutenant Ratiré, vous allez recevoir votre képi blanc. Ce képi blanc, avant vous, 500 000 légionnaires l'ont porté, dont 35 000 sont morts pour la France. Comme vos anciens, vous devrez le mériter chaque jour de votre vie. Vous le mériterez par votre volonté d'accomplir vos missions à tout prix. Vous le mériterez enfin par une fidélité sans faille à vos camarades et à la Légion étrangère. Coiffez vos képis blancs. Je vous veux servir avec honneur et fidélité. Les honneurs. count whether or not you're going to stay with us in the French Foreign Legion. The infirmary test, we can leave, you can leave maybe today, maybe tomorrow, depending on how things go. Afterwards, the intelligence test, if you are not intelligent enough, the same thing, we put you back to the civilian life. Physical test, same thing, if you do not get the 2,600 meters which we need, you're back to civilian life. Douze minutes. Deuxième coup de sifflet. Stop. Ok. T'es prêt? Two thousand six is absolute limit. Anything under two thousand six hundred meters, and there'll be civilian by the end of the evening. Gone. At the end of each day, we kick out between fifteen and twenty-five guys each day, so for every 35 they get to cast out for the end of the week, there's about a hundred and something that are kicked out. Continue, cool, cool, continue. Tu pas encore fini? Ok. Ok. At the moment, he's got what? Three or four minutes left, and he's just done the absolute minimum, so he's passed the test already. Oh. Now it's a question of well, how well he gets marked on this sheet, whether he's excellent, Trebian, or good. 
So hopefully, he's going to pass. But I said like I'm biased because he's ex-British Army. to join the, the Legion in Trangier. So I think that's going to be a big, big problem for me. Put your bag on the table and sit down. Dean William Heggie. Yeah, okay. Okay, you come here to join up the Legion for five years, that's it? Yes. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay. You know, if you want to join, we keep charge of you immediately from this moment now, and you're not allowed to write or to telephone for minimum four months, three or four months, yeah? You know that? Yeah. Okay. We pass you in front of a doctor this afternoon. If the medic decides you are fit to join, then you sign your five years contract this afternoon. Back home, uh... I mean, my parents don't know I'm here, for a start. <laughs> um, I think the only person that knows that I'm here uh, is my uncle, my uncle Frank. 
Um, but apart from that, mm, none of my friends, no, none of my family. Uh, no one. Quel est euh, votre motive de venir à agent étrangère? What is your motivation to enlist in the Legion? Um, I've joined for uh, adventure and for a military career. Avez-vous des problèmes avec la justice en Angleterre? Do you have any problems with the uh, justice with the police in uh, Great Britain? No, no trouble at all. No problem? No. Vous allez maintenant signer un contrat pour 5 ans provisoire pour l'instant ici à, à Paris. Signé ici. There is the first contract here in Paris which will become uh, definitively after a period of uh, tests. I served five years in the Marines, um, left the Marines and uh, it was about a month in civilian life. It was boring really, you know, just sitting about the house, watching television. I just needed another challenge, you know. Bit of excitement, bit of adventure. I think the next challenge was uh, the French Foreign Legion. <laughs> 